Welcome to the homework for lesson four. It's grade three, module three, and you got to have your name on here first. And we're using number bonds to help you skip count by six by either making a ten or adding to the ones. Uh, when you're adding six again and again and again, is one of the things that you find that you can do when you're skip counting by six is you're adding sixes, repeated addition, and a lot of times this is how it looks. Now here's the first example. Six plus six, well, think of six with a four and a two and you've made a ten. Ten and two is twelve. And then here with the twelve, you've got ten and two and you're adding six to the two to make eight and it's ten and eight, eighteen. And then here, you can see we've got a chance to make the next ten. 18, thinking of 6, if two, we had 2 more, that would be a 20. So there's my 20. And then 20 plus 4, 24. Next one, we're adding 6 again to 24. And you can see right here, there's a 4 and a 6, and that makes a 10. So we're looking at 20 plus 10, 30. And then we're looking at 30 plus 6. Well, don't even think about that one. It's 36. And then we have another 36, right? We've got 36 now. We're adding six more to it. So we need four more to make 10. So there's our next six is a four and a two now. So now we have 40 plus the two, 42. And now we're back to it again. So remember right when we had the 12 up here? That's going to be a 10 with a two. And then we're going to make, you'll see how it goes right here. Right, this is going to be 40 and 2, so we've got 40 plus 8, 48, and then now we have 48, and 48 plus 6, remember how we did that before? Right, we only need 2 more, like in this one here, we only need 2 more for that 48 to be a 50. 54, 50 plus 4, 54, and then 54 plus 6, 50 and 4, 4 plus 6 is 10, 50 plus 10, 60. Count by 6 to fill in the blanks below. We just did that on the first page. 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, 42, 48, 54, and 60. So that's 6, 12, 18, 24, 30. And it says complete the multiplication equation that represents the final number in your count by. So here's the final number in our count by. So we want that to be 30 as our product, and how many sixes was that? It's one, two, three, four, five sixes. And it says complete the division equation that represents your count by. So we're dividing by six, right? We're going to turn this into a division equation. So 30 is going to be our dividend, and five is going to be our quotient. And now we're looking at number three. Count by six to fill in the blanks below. We just did that. But now we have one more six. Complete the multiplication equation that represents the final number in your count by. So that means 36 is going to be our product here. So we need how many sixes? One, two, three, four, five. It's six sixes, so six times six. And the division equation, again, our product becomes a dividend. Our divisor is six, and our quotient is six. And now we're counting by six to solve 48 divided by six to show our work below. Well, we've just done this twice, except with smaller numbers, right? So we're going to start our count by 6, 12, 
18, 24, 30, 36, 42, 48. And then, right, 6 times 8, that's 8 sixes, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 6 times 8 equals 48. So that means 48 divided by 6 equals 8.